Hey guys, this is Scott Expert in the Philippines with Arlene and Darlene's and baby CJ. Wow, hasn't the earth moved around this morning? 6.0 magnitude quake here in Sunbury. Started up in Mansfield, which is up near the high country. Oh, and it's snow area. Yeah, up near the snow area. And um, a few buildings in um, Melbourne's northeast, uh, Turak and Chapel Street, have had a few foundations rocked. And Fitzroy have lost a few houses. Uh, I don't know whether it's front walls or front gates, but no, not good. Um, Unfortunately, so we had it here. If you do like that, you are you attending the rally, like no? What's that? No, in, in suddenly, you are. Um, oh, rally's got nothing to do with that. No, so. no, that the person got affected for that the house. Oh yeah. Because of earthquake, and then you are just attending for the rally. And it looks like double mistake what you did. Yeah. I think the earth's got a lot to do with the uh, movement underneath, what's going on. Uh, also, temperatures in the earth, one day it gets hot and the next day it's cold. She's going to move around a bit. I don't know, there's a bit of movement around up in the mountains and uh, all over the place. So, you know, I hope uh, everything's okay in some other places. And um, it shook big this morning because Arlene was feeding CJ and Mum was sitting in that chair having her breakfast and I was sitting at the cape kitchen table watching the, having mine, watching the birds. And next minute they all flew off and, and then, well, five minutes after that, it just shook the house. Mum's Toby jugs and everything just shook and the glass was going like that front uh, sunroom window was moving like that and then all of a sudden it sort of slowed down and then came back again and it was like a three point something magnitude quake so things are not right at the moment and not on, on top of that we've got the uh, contractors and builders uh, workers uh, rallying in the city for no jabs as I said yesterday and um, you know apparently the unions have sided with uh, management that uh, basically it's for their safety really when you look at it um, get the thing and you'll be okay you know stop complaining about it but unfortunately there's a lot of antagonists alongside those builder uh, subcontractors and contractors in the city and it doesn't help. You know, they go out on a peaceful march and before you know it, they're antagonising police and throwing rocks and throwing bottles at the union boss and that's what happened the day before yesterday where they were all out in front of the... Uh, Union headquarters throwing rocks and stuff at the police. That's not Melbourne, that's not people here, that's not the general population, that's just the population of the builders and subcontractors and uh, contractors that have got obviously friends that are antagonists and that. So, you know, unfortunately, that's how it is, and it shouldn't be. And in this time, um, what's going on in this day and age shouldn't happen like that you know we're trying to get all the numbers that case numbers down and stuff like that and then we got all this happening and it won't be long before it'll blow out and I'm not going to give figures uh, on what's going on because uh, I don't want my take channel taken down uh, that's the only reason why most people that are doing facts and figures 
and got their own channel are getting them taken down because they're giving the wrong figures out so you know they should just check first before they do anything and anyway i'll leave it at that guys just giving you an update we are expecting yep, more you guys take care have a great day enjoy and remember life is good even in the situation we're in now Bye for now guys, back later.